How much money can you actually make buying and fixing and flipping a property? That's today's show, let's dive into it. Hey everyone, I'm Clayton Morris, longtime real estate investor. I'm a buy and hold real estate investor, but my man Jerry Norton is here. He is a flipping master. He buys houses and flips them. Great to see you, Jerry. Good Welcome back. All right, so we, we, we've got up here on the glass board today, we're gonna to talk about how to fix and flip and that buying formula and what that looks like. So take us into some of the numbers here. What are some of the things you wanna figure out right, right out of the gate? Right, well, good. So with fix and flip, we follow a formula that lets us know, okay, if I, if I run my numbers and I pick up a property at X price, I can count on a certain type of profit. I factored in for all of the costs that are associated with doing this deal. So that way you kind of can know going in what your whole deal looks like. So what's great is we have our fix and flip buy formula. And the way this looks is I'll put some, I'll put some stuff up here. We have our ARV, which stands for after repair value. And then what we're going to do is we're going to multiply that by 70% or 0.70. Then we're going to subtract the repairs. And then that equals our buy that fits in the screen. So the that's our formula. That's the whole formula right here. It's like Matt Damon in Goodwill Hunting. Like, <laughs> it's like, so after repair value times 0.7, right? Because that 30% is going to be our margin to work with, right? Minus those repairs equals our buy. That's how much we want to pay for this property, right? So yeah. So if we do this, if we take this 70%, basically what we're doing is we're taking 30% off. Okay. So that 30% goes to three things, right? It goes about 9% to closing. It goes 6% to carry, we call it, which is your cost of money. Your carrying costs. Mm -hmm. You have to buy the property, pay for the repairs. So you have money. Usually you borrow that money. If you do it right, you borrow that money, 6%. And then your profit, which is the big number we're talking about today, is that 15%. Okay, so you're always gunning for a 15% profit. Mm -hmm. Most fix and flippers are looking for about that. Now you can go, if you go 65%, then you make this a 20% profit. If you go 75, you make this a 10%. So profit. that's why they always say the money in real estate, what, is always made when you buy. here when you buy. Because you're building your profit in and up front. Right, because you can see how this would change dramatically if you get this for 40, you know, 50. Yeah. So if we do an example here, let's just keep the math really simple. If we take 100,000 is our ARV. So again, ARV is what will that home sell for after you fix it up? What will the open market pay for it? You look at comparable sales to figure that out. So you give, so let's just say for simple math, it's 100,000 times 0.7 puts us at 70,000 right out of the bat, right? So before we've even done anything, we need to buy that property for 70,000. Well, now we have to figure out our repairs. Let's say the repairs are 25,000. So, right, 25,000. This is like what, fifth grade math we're doing right now, right? <laughs> right? So then we would subtract our 25,000 and then that would get to our buy price. Okay. So that would get us to our, what, 45? Yeah. Is that right? Can we get a calculator in here? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 45. There you go. So at yeah. this price, a flipper, so let's just take a, if a fix and flipper bought it for 45, they would have to pay, oh, we took it down, 9% of that would be going towards your closing costs, commissions, title insurance, transfer tax, prorations, all those fees you pay, right? 6% of that is your cost of money because we borrowed, we borrowed 45 plus 25 right, to, to fix this house up. Right. So that goes to that. 15% of that, which would be, you know, 15,000, would be our profit on that deal. And this is a pretty small size deal, 100,000, right. right, ARV. But that's the formula that you're looking at for a fix and flipper. That's great. Well, let's keep it simple. So that is the formula. If you're thinking about getting into flipping houses and actually spending the time going through the renovation process, this is the formula that you want to follow in order to build wealth. Yeah. But what's, what's cool, Clayton, is if a fix and flipper will pay 45, let's say, Clayton, you go out and you get the contract for that deal for 35. Right. Someone will pay 45 for it. So, right, there's a 10, there's 10K in between here, which you will pay. So Jerry has a program, we'll have a link in the description below. If you are the finder of a deal and you bring it to Jerry, 
Just go to the clip below this video. He will pay you $10,000 for the deal. Is that right? That's right. So I'll be your buyer. I have a program that's anywhere in the country as long as it's in the US. You find a deal like this, uh, I'll pay you $10,000 for that deal, and it's awesome. Wow, yeah. wonderful. So click the link below, check out Jerry's program. We're gonna be back with more videos in this series on how to flip properties with Jerry Norton. We'll see you, everyone.